Hi everybody, it's Undaunted Week here on Tabletop.com and we have a huge prize bundle that you could win. Our lucky winner will receive copies of Undaunted Normandy, North Africa, Reinforcements, Stalingrad, and we're even throwing in a signed copy of the Roland Revenge art book. Get your comments in on the YouTube channel and on Tabletop.com for your chance to win. Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Undaunted Week. I'm joined once again by Shay. Hello, everyone. And today we're going to be playing Stalingrad, the bestest, biggest, and newest of the Undaunted series from Osprey. Um, there's a lot going on with this game. I'm very say. excited. Yeah. Oh, I, I'm, I'm looking forward to getting all the Fog of War cards thrown at me uh, Good. once again. Yeah. Good. So before we dive into the game, I thought I'd very quickly tell you what's going on with Stalingrad because there's a few components to worry about. Um, first up, we have our board, our layout, which will be familiar to anybody who's played any of the other Undaunted games. However, a couple of things to note. Uh, the coloured strips, there are 72 tiles for Stalingrad in its entirety. Each of these is a street, and you'll actually notice that all the streets line up and the houses line up uh, when they're adjacent. Um, so you build your Stalingrad your way. However, there are some things that can change as you play through. So, for example, the waterworks here are marked off as buildings, as are some of these tiles here. Um, and if they get hit by a bomb or an anti-tank or a demo charge, you take them from this part uh, and then replace the requisite tile. So this is your, your living city of Stalingrad, and these are ones that have been demolished or destroyed. So as you play through, your actual city itself changes um, depending on what you do and when you do it. So if you blow up a building in this mission and then you revisit this area in a subsequent mission down the line in the campaign, it will have remained blowed up, um, which changes all sorts of things about it, whether or not vehicles can move into it, how much terrain there is for cover. Uh, you can also fortify, and again, once you fortify an area, it stays fortified. So these changes that you make to Stalingrad are as important as your force itself. Speaking of forces, uh, there's also a bit of bookkeeping with that. So I'll, th I'll show you mine. There's two trays in the actual box. This is my German tray, um, and when you're playing your force is drawn from this section. You'll be told to sometimes unlock uh, cards from in here as you go through the campaign. This might contain snipers or engineers or other things. Sometimes you unlock them forever. Sometimes they're just unlocked for one scenario and then they go back. So the military send you some guys to do a job, like demolishing a bridge. Uh, but then after they're finished, they're not part of your platoon. They are recalled back to headquarters. Uh, and here are upgrades, again, as you play at the end of the campaign, or at the end of every scenario in the campaign, some of your troops may be upgraded. Um, these are cards that have been taken out of the game altogether. So either they are troops that have been upgraded or they are troops that have been injured. And if they've been injured, uh, if you've lost them as casualties, then you take some from your reserve. And these are sort of downgrades. Uh, so you end up again with a force that is as representative of a combined force going into a city and staying there over time. Some veterans become better, some become worse. Uh, with that in mind, we've actually played through several games, so we've already suffered uh, some unfortunate setbacks. Many casualties, yeah. Many, many casualties. This is Stalingrad. Yeah. Now, I haven't actually seen if it says in the rules to do this, because I, I was just sort of... Uh, flicking back and forth trying to see. When you play a game, you always set up your deck and then you set up your support. All of the cards are numbered. So there are five Rifleman cards. So Rifleman number one might get injured. Rifleman number three might get upgraded. Uh, and then they stay like that. So when it comes to making your, your baseline deck and then your bolster decks, myself and Shay have actually put them into sequential order because otherwise you'd be tempted to just stack all the really good ones at the top 
you know, yeah, you start so you, you start you start with the upgrades. Ones. You start with the yeah, and and so it made more sense to just have them in that order because you draw them randomly when they are getting upgrades or when they are getting casualtyed. Um, so it means my starting deck uh, B squad has taken a massive pasting over time. Um, a lot of riflemen and machine gunners have suffered for the steps they've taken into Stalingrad. A's mostly got off scot free, uh, but it does mean that. When I put the the baseline deck together, I think the only injured rifleman from A ended up in my deck, and you know the only non upgraded or injured B went in. It was you know mm. it's just one of those things who you don't really know what way you're going to be approaching the game and the resources you're going to have. So I just thought it makes sense to do it in that order. Um, I have for this mission unlocked my or I've got my snipers. They unlocked them a little while ago. All three of them have been upgraded. Uh, and because Stalingrad plays like the other Undaunted games where you're just playing through a uh, a turn and the card you draw is that man in that moment, it means even though your counter, so Rifleman A may be in the middle of a fight, you might suddenly draw a counter that says that you've actually, it's one of the reserves who can't move. So he has to sit there and it might change exactly what you wanted to do in a turn because he can't, run and skip and jump. Yeah, you can't do that one action yeah. I wanted him to. Yeah. Um, you also got uh, a few bits and bobs in yours. Yeah. Uh, right, uh, Rifleman Squad B, two of them got upgraded, two of them got butchered. Oh, well. <laughs> As you do. Both of my snipers got upgraded. One of them did, unfortunately, pass. Well, yeah, because you would have three sniper cards, but yes. uh, but yeah, one's gone and now you've got uh, a pair of, of snipers left. So in that way, your your force changes over time. So it's it's very interesting on having to deal with those sort of things when you actually plow into a game, not always having everything at full effect like you would in the other un, uh, Undaunted games. Mm -hmm. So Stalingrad offers a, a whole new way to look at the warfare within the... Uh, the Eastern Front. Um, so we are going to be playing a mission on the western side of Stalingrad. Um, I'll give you my briefing first and then Shay can tell you what he's been sent here to do. The lieutenant stalked into the half-collapsed basement. As you were, the officer instructed, as Max and the other NCOs rose to their feet. A sheaf of papers had been rolled out across the table placed in a patch of light that was beaming down through the gap in the ceiling above the basement. These buildings here, the lieutenant said, pointing out a small collection of structures south of 9 January Square. Reports indicate that Soviet engineer is present and he's in the process of fortifying. Give him a day or two and this junction of streets will be nigh impregnable. With the Soviets still holding the square, we can't afford to let them extend their influence like that. We need to take the southern reach. We're going bunker busting then. Otto said, his youthful expression unusually grave. Something like that, the lieutenant confirmed. The good news is, command have seconded a bomber sortie to support our attack today. They're expected to start the run in the next half hour. Get your troops ready. Oh. And for the Soviets. For the Soviets. Yuri planted his hands on his hips, watching his Maxim squad worked away under the engineer's instructions. Darkness was steadily falling over the bullet-riddled storehouse as sandbags were heaped up and boards were hammered into place over windows and doorways. It's starting to feel like a tomb, he said to the engineer, a youth who, despite his lack of years, was directing Maxim's troops with what Yuri considered to be an acceptable degree of confidence. Tombs make for good defensive sites, the engineer pointed out as he tested the nails on one of his boards, screening the storefront. And besides, what better place to die? Yuri smiled to fight him, despite himself. The boy was right enough. He turned and hefted one of the sandbags needed for the doorway, nodding to Maxim as he did so. 9 January Square was still under Soviet control. Now they were seeking to push into the southern reach and drive the Wehrmacht dogs from their sector too. Faster, all of you, Yuri ordered the labouring squad as he dumped the sandbag into place. Tumor or not, the Germans don't tend to wait for the renovations to be completed. So there you have it, uh, a fight over control of the Southern Reach. In this mission, we both have the same objective, which is to control five mission points. Yeah. Uh, mission points are two, 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 one, 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 one. 
and like I say, the Soviets are already in there. And that's actually an upgraded engineer for this scenario as well. So he's a Love bit it. filthy. Love it. Okay, so we should be right back to begin the game. All right, we're back. And the Germans have the initiative to begin with. We still... They always do. But I can lose that in the initiative phase. So one, two, three, four cards. Let's see what the gods have gifted me. Oh, it's a brave new world. Whole new world. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm going to go with... Uh -huh. Oh, snatching it back right from the start. Yes, we need that initiative. Yeah, okay. So with that in mind then, uh, you get the initiative and you get first dibs. Good, 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 good. Right. Feel free to bring the building down on top of your head. I would say no. Well, not quite. No. I did get my brand new upgraded engineer, eh? Oh, God. However, and... Uh, He's going to start places in mines. Oh, right. Okay. So he is, I think, he can place two mine. I think. Yeah. He's got mine two. Yeah. That's nice. I like that. <laughs> Very much like that. So where are they going to go then? So mines um, have to go across one of the edges of the tile you're in into yes. another tile. So. so let's go with, where are my little tiles? There they are. He is squad A. Let's go with there and there. Okie dokie. Just really annoy you. It's both fortified and mine. Nothing really do, going to do get in. Mm. Never. Don't be daft. And um, who's next? <laughs> let's go with uh, Rifleman A. Yeah, we'll go next. Rifleman Fairly standard. A. Yep. Uh, Rifleman A, he's just going to move up there, I think. Just move up there. Uh, next up, we'll have Squad Leader A. He'll go. Because why not? Oh. Uh, Before you do that, that one will actually count for both of those. So you don't put it on the same side. Uh, so you can stick it somewhere else. Okay. Uh, even worse. Okay then. Very nice. So next, squad uh, leader. Squad leader A. He can inspire anyone I've already... He can inspire anybody from the same squad. Yes. So yes. Uh, can it be Squad A, even though I haven't played him yet? No, has to be somebody yeah, who's be somebody, uh, yeah. in your play area. Uh, could mine again. <laughs> no, we won't do that. I'm not that filthy. That's all I am, that filthy. Yeah, um, very much so. I tell you what, we will just bolster, actually. Okay. So we will bolster two for me. So you're taking scouts. And, and a machine gunner. Ooh. And an engineer, actually. Oh, oh that's better. Yes. I don't mind that. I do mind the... Uh, Do you mind the mines? <laughs> you I, do mind the mines, I yeah. do mind the mines. I do like it when mines are Okay. For myself, then, uh, I'm going to start with my platoon sergeant, Ooh. who will bolster three. Don't like that. No, well, few people do. Um, <laughs> God, everybody's terrible. <laughs> uh, I think I will go for... Just don't pick from Rifle Squad B. <laughs> I'm going to... That's a fair choice. <laughs> I'm going to pluck two snipers and a bomber. Oh. Yeah. Oh, that's not very nice. Well, you know, while it's still early doors and I have more of a chance of getting them out more often, late game I can start bringing the other people in. Mm -hmm. uh, and then I'm going to play my scout from A Squad. And he will... Start, start to blaze a trail that others may follow. So, one, two to there. And it's been so long since I've picked up a Fog of War card. <laughs> uh, and then finally, I will play Squad Leader for A. Um, could inspire that scout again. And I think I will. So... Scout to there for another fog, and scout to there. Are you picking up all the fog cards now so that I can give them to you? Yes. Okay. That's that very much what I'm doing. That's genius. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Did it's, I uh, fun? I'll tell you really. 
I'm not having fun. I don't know why. <laughs> <laughs> right. Next up. In like Flynn there. One, two, three, and four. Can I get that initiative back? Two, I want that initiative back. You're not getting that initiative back. <laughs> <laughs> that is probably very true. Okay, so that's good. That's not as good. That's kind of interesting. Our survey says yeah, fogging it. Yeah. Fog gets fog. All right, then you get to keep the initiative. But good, uh, good, good, good. I like that. Right. Um, don't have very much I could do. Um, first off, we're going to play platoon sergeant. Mm -hmm. uh, commanders take two from my deck. Deck, yes, Most into your hand. From my supply. Yep. So do you want some extra movement Ooh, early on? I kind of do because you've already. Yeah, I'm going to command. I'm going to command my last two cards. Okay. Into my hand. One of which is hopefully a fog of war. Uh, no, it doesn't already have that in my hand. Oh, you already have that in your hand. Oh, well, that's <laughs> yeah. good. Um, so next up, let's play. You could always recon it away. Yeah, exactly. I could. Uh, but scout B. Yes. Is going to scout scout. Right. Oh. We're going to scout to here. Give you a scout token. Scout to there. Give you a scout token and two foggers of war. Yeah. Enjoy this. Uh, I don't like these. I didn't have, <laughs> I didn't have any of these last game. I don't know what it was. It's because you didn't move. Yeah. <laughs> That's why. I, I didn't have to. <laughs> uh, okay. Next up, we've got Scout A. Oh. He's going to do a bit of Scouty Scout as well. So we're just going to go there and there for his Scout. And our Fog of War card. Don't like these Fogs of War. No. Very fun. They, fi they fill up quickly. Yeah. It's awful. Uh, last but not least, we've got Rifleman B, one mm -hmm. of the ones who isn't isn't actually. I think, he's, I think he's actually the only one who isn't injured in uh, <laughs> Rifleman Squad B. Actually, let's say that um, Rifleman B. Oh, get moving! Blaze a trail that others may follow. It could very well. Yeah, it's because uh, it would take a pot shot at your rifle, but he's got three cover. Yeah. Like, there's not much of a point there, really, is there? So let's that's, that's just move on. It would be tricky to do much to him, yeah. My final card is a... Okay. Eel Fog of War. Is that right? And then for myself, I have Rifleman A. Uh, he's actually one of my reserve. Oh, so he's amazing. He, he He's not the worst reserve I've got. He can still move, he can still control, and he can still attack. Ah. Uh, he can only attack, mind you, if you're in the same... Has he got an entrenching tool? Yeah, he's got an entrenching tool. Uh, he just batters you over the head. Ah. Uh, so. A man of culture, I see. <laughs> Do I want to go. Actually, we'll go to there. Oh. And then. Shoe, shoe driven. <laughs> and then I'm going to go with uh, Scout from B. Mm hmm. And he's just going to move to there try and reinforce my flank somewhat mm -hmm. and then finally I'm going to get my squad leader from B wow. and uh, do I want to inspire my scout to take a shot at you wow. I think I will I think I'm going to attempt to shoot your scout who's currently in a bit of blown up area that wow. doesn't have any uh, any cover Why? so it's What's five for your defense mean? six for that and why you know why, Mr. Conceal, King of the Conceals. Wow. <laughs> nope. That's what you get. It's just a little warning shot. It's just reminding you I'm here. That's well, all that is. Now all he's going to do is give you five war cards. <laughs> he's going to get that fortification set there for the rest of his days. <laughs> <laughs> right. Next turn then. Yes. I only have one card to draw. Yeah, I don't so have I'm any have cards left. Reshuffle. Oh, so I've got five. I can't count, apparently. <laughs> dare me. This is I'm, going well. I'm saying nothing. <laughs> this is going well. How dare you? Uh, one, two, three. I already two, know what card I'm going to pick. Four. This one. This card. Right. Well, I'm picking that card. Our survey says Fogs of War. Now, Jerry, you're going to be uh, quite happy with, your, <laughs> with this turn. Am I, though? I don't feel like I will be, but go ahead. Uh, 
Well, this is the only actual card I have. No, oh, it's Because the other three in my hand were Fog of Wars. Excellent. But I will recon one of these away. Yes. Out of the game for good. Into, so, out of the game for good. Out of the game for good when you recon. It goes out of the game. And you draw a card from your deck and play that immediately. So you might be able to actually get something. Cool, play that immediately. It's a fuckable card. Oh, dear. And my other one is also a fuckable card. Oh, no. <laughs> But no, I know how it feels. At least, <laughs> at least one of the fogs is gone forever. Yeah, exactly. So that's okay. Good turn, Scout B. <laughs> well done. Uh, I've got Rifleman A again. God bless his cotton socks. <laughs> is he going to charge me with his shovel? He's, he is going to charge me with his shovel. Yeah. Charge a battle for Mosin with a shovel of genius. Uh, he, won't, he won't hit you. <laughs> he won't. He might. You never know. <laughs> uh, I'm actually just going to. Oh, I can't yeah. because that's not scouted. Uh -huh. Ooh, uh, mm. uh -huh. So I'm going to move to there. Walk into one of the mines, I dare <laughs> it's, uh, it's interesting. I don't know how good mines actually are. All I know is I can place them. That's what I did. I am going to play squad leader A. Um, and I'm going to bolster. Oh my God. I'm going to actually bolster rifleman and machine gunner. Who are both upgraded? They're both veterans. Ooh, that good. will hopefully, because at the moment all I'm seeing is terrible rifleman limpy <laughs> with a shovel. With a shovel. <laughs> Lastly, I have a fog of war card as well. Oh. So that's all she wrote for that. It's a brave new world, my friends. Brave new world. Do I actually need you to do anything? <laughs> Isn't that the eternal question? Are we ready? Mm. Yep. Jerry's, Jerry's going to oh, poker. Oh. This is the problem. Right. Our survey says. Yeah, I knew that was going to happen. <laughs> <laughs> Big six. Throwing, throwing Skype B to the wolves there. There you go. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. No. It's okay. Give, give yourself some more fog over parts. <laughs> so I am going to start by. Moving Rifleman B. Friedrich. He can just come south one. And then I'm actually going to spawn in my sniper. Ew. Sniper Elite. Uh, so when you're spawning these days, there are no spawn points. Instead, you come out on a Rifleman token. Um, if it's a squad member, it has to come out on the right rifleman. If it's somebody like a sniper who doesn't have a squad affiliated, you could come to either of them. So I will pop into there. Wow. And uh, for his action, he is going to take an attack. Wow. I don't know what I'm saying. <laughs> I didn't expect anything else. Well, you know, he does get a three dice attack if he's over range one or one or over mm -hmm. so everybody is fair game at the moment who wants it uh this rifleman b wants it i think i have another oh. dice please yes of course yeah. pack so defense four five for the building six seven for the range Ooh. Oh, yes. Oh, none. Oh, yes. But at least, you know, she was willing. Gives you a bit of an idea that something nasty might be going on. Mm -hmm. And then for my last card, I'm going to oh. bomb the area. Oh, that's not good. Mm. I don't like bombs. No, well, uh, nobody likes bombs, but say to me. Oh, you do. I do. I do like bombs. That is true. So, no. I can't help but feel like, yeah, I'm going to drop on this rifleman. It'd be nice if you were clustered and everybody was in one area. I made mean, sure everyone was spread out. I that, definitely didn't. That Just would be great. As soon as you put that down, and went, oh, no, oh, it's fine. But it's totally yeah. <laughs> there's not much you can do there. Uh, two dice bombing run uh, on fives. No range because it's coming in straight on top of your head. Mm -hmm. Oh, there's a hit. That is a hit. That'll be a uh, 
Do, you don't have one in there? Don't have one in your discard before you go digging? No, they're all... No, they're all foggable cards. They're all fogs. <laughs> Sigma Scout. Uh, Rifleman B. Let's go. Rifleman B. There he is. Goodbye, my friend. Casualty. And I will reshuffle these. Mm. Good thing is, I did get all of my Fog of War cards out in that one turn. That the is... rest of my turns are now Blitzkrieg. Well, you, you Krieg all your blitzing then. <laughs> you go right ahead. I have nothing else to do. Good, good. We like that. Um, Scout A. Scout A will go. Mm -hmm. Scout A is going to give you a Fog of War card. <laughs> Oh, right. Yeah. It's one of those, is it? <laughs> it's always oh, one of those. Okay. Probably should have scouted him into that two square there. Yeah, I that mean... That would have been the smart decision. I, I mean, you could you could try and win in this turn if you did that. Yeah, I've already seen that. Yeah. But, you know, I've already said it, so... Oh, well. It is what it is. You've got another scout. Um, True, I do, yeah. You're correct. We're even in there. Oh, nice. Yeah, it's very close to the first one. <laughs> it's very helpful, yeah. yeah. In fact, yeah, we will... Uh, actually, oh, I can't do that because he's not been played yet. Well, we'll, uh, we'll, we'll bolster... Two Bs. Okay. That's all she can do. Uh, let's go with... Let's go with a Scout B and a really bad Rifleman B who just has a token. Oh, well. Uh, five, last but not least, we've got Platoon Sergeant. And you know what I'm going to command to? Command? Yes. Makes sense. Yes. Oh, we love to see it. We love to see it. Yes. Right. So, Scout A is going to go again. Ooh. And he's going to Uno. Yep. Pick up another Fogly War. Yes. Indeed. I can move again. He can. You know yeah. What? yeah, he's got to join Engineer A. Okay. In his little fortification. As he does. Speaking of Engineer A. Engineer A is now. Ooh. Engineer A. Um Mm -hmm. Not much you can do because all of his attack and his demo are both same square. Yeah, well, but yeah, he will do because he literally, apart from moving, the only thing he can do is put more mines down. So he's going to mine that off. <laughs> and mine that off. <laughs> Doesn't matter if you wanted this fortification, <laughs> you're getting blown up. <laughs> it's good to have a hobby. Yeah, exactly. He loves it. He loves it really. Okie dokie, all done. Yeah, that is me. I'm destroying Stalin. There we go. Okay then, so ready for the next turn? Yes. <gasps> Two, three, four. Get rid of these first. Still have cards. Yeah. Wonder how many of them are Fog of War. One, two, three. Got to redraw. <gasps> Get some fogs. I'm going to add all the Fog of War lovely, cards. Lovely, lovely Fog of top. War, yeah. Because I'm great at cheating with cards. I'm not. <laughs> There we go. Always oh, look at that. <laughs> it's good. It's fantastic. Um, All right. Yep. So, for initiative, then. Fogly. Give me that initiative back. You can have that initiative back. I need to get rid of some fog. <laughs> <laughs> um, right. Okay. Let's go with. The old engineer, eh? Okay. I think. Hmm. Hmm. Engineer A may leave his little foxhole that he's bought himself. <laughs> so we might. Quilly. I think you might. God bless him. <laughs> God bless his little cotton socks. Yep. Um, yeah, you know, for, for the fun of it, let's, let's go for it. Um, oh, do I go for your rifleman, though? Oh, no, nah, let's go for this guy. He's an easy target. <laughs> <laughs> Engineer, he's going to go there. Yep. That's his move. Okay. Then squad leader A is going to inspire him. Oh, activate again. An attack. Okay. Against your scout. So he is has to be in the same square. But yes. He gets two dice. Okay. Chucking uh, a ball. Like um, so because you're in the same square, you use the lower value. Mm -hmm. So I have a defense of six. Come on. Love it. Oh. Brilliant. Fantastic. Oh, you absolute fiend. <laughs> it, he was in my hand. Yes. <laughs> you love to see it. Scout A. Engineer A. 
Same thing. Um, I hate you so much. <laughs> you know you love it. So much. Um, last but not least, we've got Rifleman now. Yep. Here's just going to pop over one to there. That's him. Okie dokie. Jumping into there. Right. Grand. Fab. Groovy. That has completely banjacked my plans. Um, so my squad leader B is going to bolster two riflemen who are all injured because B is not <laughs> B is not in a good way. B is not a good squad. And uh, I have not. a fog of war oh, for my last. Yes. So I'm just going to re- one good card. I'm just going to recon it away with my scout. <laughs> Brilliant. I hope I get nothing but snipers and just spend my time taking <laughs> pot shots at you. <laughs> Till you, get, oh. till you get nervous when you can't see a German, and then you get nervous when you can see a German. <laughs> That's my goal. Good. Good. I can't believe you killed my snipe. Ah, you're just the worst. Just the absolute worst. Okay. Right? Ready? Yes. Ba, 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 ba. Oh, ugly. Spend a big card on that one. Just, yeah. Just to keep it. Just to keep it. Um, but you won't be very happy to hear. It's probably good to do, though. It probably is, yeah, because uh, Engineer is going again. Oh. He's going to attack your scout again. Oh. Just in case you have another one. Okay. You never know. Um, let me just check. <laughs> You'll find out if you manage to win them. <laughs> right. So back to uh, sixes. sixes. Sixes, yes. Oh, it makes Ooh. a six. That counts, right? It, no, it does not. It does not count. <laughs> Right, matey boy. <laughs> Anything else? Uh, yes, we've got Platoon Sergeant. Yep. Who's going to... Oh, I need to start bolstering. Really, don't I? Maybe. He's going to bolster a rifle. I feel like you have to. He's going to bolster a rifle with B. Mm-hmm. And then he's going to bolster a sniper. Ooh, controversial. Indeed. And then my last fall over. Ah, okay. Fair enough. Fair enough. So, I'm going to start with my platoon sergeant. Oh. Uh, I do like the idea of bolstering massively. Um, Get some more of those right from the bays in your squad. But I'm, I'm actually going to go for command oh. instead. No more right from the bays. Come on. You're the best you mentioned. <laughs> okay. Tis but a scratch, some would say. Some would. I wouldn't. <laughs> Do you think that's funny? Have a four dice sniper attack oh. from uh, Gerhardt oh. Engel. Right. Who's like one and two? Uh, oh, there's so many to choose from. <laughs> I think into. Right from a B. Ooh, actually, no, I'm going to go into this. Right, right from an A. A. I dare so you. one, two, three, seven. So four, four dice, dice on seven. sevens. Got more Jerry rules. Let's go. <laughs> Hasn't hit once yet. That's true. I haven't, have I? Oh, you've hit. I, I hit that hit, time. Though, hit seven, eight, nine times. times. Yeah. Yeah. What a shame! Mm. What a shame! Only does one damage there. <laughs> it would have been hit off the board as well. Yeah. Um, right. Right from the day is uh, right. Right from the day. Right from the day here. There he is. Right from the day is gone. Dead. Good. And then I'm going to go for Rifleman A, oh. and he's going to control oh. to take that area. Oh. And then I'm going to go with my squad leader to inspire him to move. Oh. Bump, bump. And my last is another fog of war because... Of course it is. Of course, there were so many in there, it was always going to be. I'm waiting to get just nothing but fogs of war because of you, you fiend. Me? Never. No. Fogs of War? Never. <laughs> okay. Ready? Yep. Ooh, one of your low levels. Yes, yes. She's gone. An initiative frisky snipers. Indeed. Or scout. Indeed. So first off, we've got Scout A. Mm. He's going to get rid of Fog of War card in okay. my hand oh. forever. So you get the draw on you gone, from gone. your deck. Uh, what's best in our for a fog of war card? Would you look at that? It's my fog of war card. That's good. I like that. But you know, that's, 
You've got rid of two so far. I've not managed to get rid of any because somebody keeps killing my scouts when they're about to. <laughs> Me? No. Yes, <laughs> you. No. Um, last but not least, we've got squad leader B. Mm -hmm. She is going to inspire Rifleman B here to control that. Can't. Has to be a card that's already been played. Oh, so it does. Yep. Never mind, we've got a bolster. You got a bolster? Yes. No. I got a bolster. Okay. Got that. Let's get a rifle B. Stocking up on the rifles. Yes, because I have a feeling you're going to kill all of them. Get, I might not. Let's get a machine gunner B as well. Why not? Machine guns are fun. That is true. Machine guns are fun. Mm. Um, and we'll see how fun they are now because I'm going to spawn ah. a machine gunner mm. at Rifleman A there. Oh, that's not fun. And uh, he's going to lay down covering fire. I don't know if he's going to lay down covering fire. He may just suppress. He's going to suppress Rifleman A. No. Yes. <laughs> yes, he is. So Rifleman A is one, two, three, seven. Four dice on sevens. If you would just cluster a bit more, I've got great new abilities on these no. people. Yep, oh, got him. one there. He gets to be suppressed. Uh, I feel much better now about life in general. You shouldn't. And, you should feel awful. And Stalingrad in particular. You should never feel better in Stalingrad. It's a good life for anyone. <laughs> no. <clears throat> uh, squad leader B is going to bolster. The bolster scout. B and Rifleman B. More scouts. Why would you do that? Somebody shot the last one in the face. <laughs> and then Rifleman A is going to go. Mm -hmm. And he's actually going to control. Mm -hmm. And that's the end of my face. All right. <laughs> Decisions. Is that a big decision? No. No, it's not. No, it <laughs> not at all. Not a baby. No, not, not the size. <laughs> not, um, not with so many in my hand, in it, anyway, <laughs> i tell you that. Um, right. Okay. I'm going to go for a risky play here. Yes. Well, we like risky plays. I think B. Yep. Over here. Mm -hmm. A bit, bit banged up. He swapped his nose in for a topograph. He's not happy with it. <laughs> it wasn't his choice. He is actually going to control that one. Yes. I would like to move him towards the twos, because the twos are obviously more valuable. Yeah. yeah. I think. Yeah. I think that, that uh, having be. having one on the board is better than Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. That's what I was thinking. Next up we have one of my amazing elite snipers. Oh, sniper yes. elite. Yes. Where are they going to come in? Well, it's a rifleman A or rifleman B. Yeah. It literally doesn't matter. No. They're both equally away from who I want to shoot in the face. Why would you want to shoot anybody in the face? There's a rainbow there. Oh, man. And then she will... Uh, shoot? She's actually going to reposition. Oh. Which lets me shoot her and then move. Okay. Right in the face. Makes sense. <laughs> right in the face. So, um, has to be more than one space away. I That's fine. I shoot right from an A. Yeah. Because I don't like it. Thought you might. Yeah. However, I am in a building here. So, yeah. six, seven... Yes. Yes. Eight. Eight. Yes. Eight needed. Three dice. There's an eight. She is a bit elite, isn't she? She is. She's amazing. Yeah. Someone say fantastic. I don't have any in my hand. There's uh, right from an A. Dead now. Good. And lastly, we have. Oh, fog of war. Fog okay. Of war card, yeah. And that's me. That could have been worse for me. Yeah, exactly. It has to be said, it could have been a lot, lot worse. We really lost one, one, one reservist. You don't need them. Got more than that. Yep. Mmm. Mmm. Okay. Well, all right. Fair enough. I mean, the fact I can doesn't mean I should. Uh, I'm going to go for sniper. Uh, we're going to. Oh. oh, you didn't do your move for your reposition. Oh, so I didn't. Thank you very much. Um, I'll let you do that since I'm. There. About to do stuff. In the cover. Yeah, because otherwise I would have shot her in the face for yeah. counter sniper fire. <laughs> um, but I won't in this case, will I? Five, eight, nine. It would be three dice on tens to mm. deal with her. And that mm. just seems a bit too much. 
Um, but what I will do is I'm going to shoot Scout A. Oh. Uh, no, you are in a fortified area there, though. So that counts as uh, two cover. So seven. Good. So eights. Eights needed. Three dice on eights. Three dice? Oh, it's sniper. I've always said Scout. Oh. Yeah. Oh, I was going to say, that's a really good Scout. <laughs> yep. The upgraded ability is Scout, oh, so it can do right. both. Yes, okay, fair enough. Nine. A <sighs> hit. Snape. He's just on Scout A. Scout A. Scout A. Lose one yeah. from your... No. There. Lose one from your deck, then. Scout A, there he is. Frankie Ball. Nope, not Frankie Ball. Uh, that name I can't pronounce. Okay. That's wrong. I'm going to uh, bomb... No. Rifleman A. No. Yes. No. Yes. Him. Rifleman A. Good old cheeky Rifleman A. With a mighty uh, cover of one there, so fives. Two dice. I'm sorry, Rifleman A. <laughs> I'm not. <laughs> I need to stop him from controlling or moving forward. Oh, yeah. That um, it's another hit. Rifleman A. It's not in there because I haven't used him yet. And my last is a fog of war. Good. Good. Maybe you deserve it. I don't think I do. Right I mean, if there. I deserved it. Oh, no. It's one of my elite rifle bidets. Oh, excellent. It's not very nice. Uh, these things are said to try us. And I don't think I have any more rifle bidets in my hand. Uh, well, I've happened twice. Yeah. Do you, I imagine you've still got two or three there. Three, three yeah. Yeah, yeah. So another hit and he gets routed. He starts moving backwards. Oof, I don't like that. That's good. Right. That can keep my mischief. <laughs> mm, indeed. All righty. Uh... Yes. Oh, oh. Just about won that one. <laughs> Just about... Was actually going to use a different card that was a uh, one lower than yours, <laughs> uh, which I'm going to use now. Okay, it's engineer. A. Ooh, he's going to try to blow up Scout A again. <laughs> well, he's been in there for a while. Yeah, it's exactly. been a, a little bit. Two dice on sixes. I think. Yes. If I remember correctly. Oh. There's a nine. That does it. Yeah, it does do it. I have none in your hand. Oh, I was hoping. I was really hoping. I've none in my hand. I may not even have any in my deck. I might get um, retreated, which is good because it shows people retreated. Yeah, 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 no, all my scouts are there. Sure. So, what happens whenever you would normally take a casualty and lift the marker off? Instead, you retreat to an adjacent controlled or scouted square, and he gets a little uh, flag on him there to show that he's routed. He can't do anything until he's bolstered, but when I bolster it, I take that away, and then it means he can be mm -hmm. pushed back again if needs be. Who's Fair next? Enough. Uh, next up, we are going to have Squad Leader B, mm -hmm. who is going to bolster. Okay. He's going to bolster two machine gunners. Yes. Ooh, because you need them. Yes, I really do need them. <laughs> I really do need them. Yep. Um, lastly, we have Squad Leader A, mm -hmm. who is going to bolster two riflemen, believe it or not. I, I can well believe it, yeah. 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 And that is me. Okie dokie. So. I am going to activate Scout B, who's going to scout into there. Look, I'm taking a Fog of War card. Don't you enjoy On that? Purpose? Are you mad? Yeah, yeah, well, you know, I'm like that. And then I'm going to activate uh, Rifleman B. Do that one first. So he's going to move to there. And then I'm going to activate Rifleman B to attack your Rifleman <gasps> B. So six required. That's a single nice. dice. No, it's not nice, you're right. But. Very disappointing, Jerry. Go. Oh. Good. You deserve it. But I'm starting to put pressure on you. Yeah, you are. I don't like it. I've already got one card. I have to shuffle up. Is this the turn for all the Fog of Wars for me? I've not had a really terrible Fog of War <laughs> spam yet. Oops. But I imagine I will do shortly. OK. 
Okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Ready? Mm. Nice. Yes. Fog of War. Yes. Good. Because all of my cards, I don't know what to give away. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I had a very similar, yes. similar feeling myself, yeah. Yes. Indeed. Right. I have run out of mines, unfortunately. <laughs> 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 this is quite a problem. Because <laughs> uh, I was going to mine this <laughs> so yeah. you couldn't get past. It, well, it makes uh, sense. Well, I could get past. I'd just have to sacrifice somebody. Yes. Just run a, a scout or a machine gunner into it. Which would not be nice. Well, I wouldn't um, have liked it. You could demo the building I'm in. <laughs> for some yeah, reason you could I don't, you could I don't really I mean yeah I mean does it help advance your goals in this part of Stalingrad no, no. <laughs> it's my city why would I level it <laughs> that's your job I mean Engineer A is just going to do nothing because I can't attack because it has to be in the same yeah, square you, you can always do nothing I can't I'm not going to demo and I can't mine I'm not going to move yeah yeah. Yeah. He's, he's that's that's fine. Chill out. Yeah. Just, he's just going to stay in a square. Yeah, exactly. Just enjoying life here. Yeah. Yeah. It actually has a more defense than his fortress does. That is true. Well, it doesn't have mines, that's the problem. Wife and bees next. Mm hmm. Could drop a grenade at my own feet, which would be funny. But I'm just going to attack you. Okay. Because <laughs> I'm not an idiot. Well. Yeah. So a six single, single die attack? Yeah. Yeah. Scout B, we're going to go for single attack. So just a six needed. Seven. Seven. You'll get it. Bang. By Jingo. Uh, I will have to go and look at my deck because I don't have any in my hands. Good. Good. Uh, while you're doing that, I'm going to play Platoon Sergeant. Uh-huh. He's going to command two for myself. Ooh. Oh, that's helpful. Scout B, yeah. It's not helpful. Um, oh, actually, no, it actually kind of is helpful. Yeah. I'm actually, I don't know I say that. Um, I got a Scout A. Mm -hmm. He's going to Get rid of my Fog of War card. <gasps> Swap it for another one. Oh! That's even more useless. That Fog of War card yes, is discarded. It does. I keep forgetting that. Thank you. Um, yeah. Even more useless. It's uh, Scout B, who is not very happy with her current situation. Hey, you know, he's not too bad. I don't know where she is. Right slap bang in the middle. Oh, so she is, yeah. Very nice. Um, <laughs> could give you another Fog of War card. <laughs> Should be pretty funny. Mm. Uh but I'm not going to do that. I'm going to take a shot at Scout B. Mm hmm. By himself, the land of the Yes. So, five for your natural cover, one for the house, and then one tile away. Yep. So, seven. Yep. It's an eight. It's an eight. So, I know there's still none in my hand because there wasn't a minute ago either. Oh, I've shuffled Scout B right to the bottom. There you go. That was handy. He wasn't going to activate anytime soon anyway, then. Yep. <laughs> and I don't have to reshuffle the rest of that deck. There you go. Perfect. Everything's coming up, Millhouse. <laughs> That's me. Done. Yep, that is me. I am going to play my platoon sergeant to command twice. Oh. That's good. That's very good. Uh, these three Fog of War cards I'm just going to put straight <laughs> into my discard. <laughs> but at least, now, at least now I can actually activate something else. Oh. My machine gunner. Ah, I see. So my machine gunner is going to... Um, it's going to attempt to. Oh my god, I hit all of them. There are no good <laughs> options here. One, two, three, four, eight. I think he's going to go for a two dice attack on eight to attempt to wound Rifleman B. Oh. Because I need him to go away. Ooh. Oh, a 10 will do it. Right, give him a minute. <laughs> Rifleman B. Thankfully, you reinforced Rifleman B or bolstered quite a bit. So. Rifleman B. It's Tokarev boy. Mm. No, he was my favorite. <laughs> he was, and he was awful. But that's all I can do. Yes. I've only got two cards left, so I'll have to reshuffle. If you could just start putting all your men together so I can like do more um, area attacks. No, that, actually, I think great. it's okay. No? You sure? Yeah, yeah I think we're out. Okay, Actually, no, no, you're right. not, not entirely certain <laughs> why there, to be fair. <laughs> oh, they're not bad. 
Uh, I just think. I'm thinking. That's, you can probably hear the wheels turning there. Come on, Jerry. Okay. Like I've, I've thunked. Oh. Squad leader or initiative back. comes back to me. I literally didn't have a card in my hand that could beat that. <laughs> <laughs> That's even better then. I think I didn't waste one. Yeah. Okay. So, my sniper. Sniper. Uh, is going to attempt to shoot your engineer repeatedly in the face. No. Yep. Okay. So, one, two, uh, plus three. So five, so ten. ten. Ten on three dice. Don't you dare. <laughs> oh, I dare. I dare. I don't know if I'll get it, but I dare. Oh, yes. Oh. Brilliant. Love it. What was that you said about adding them up earlier? Uh, don't worry about it. <laughs> <laughs> and then Rifleman A is... Um, he's going to move in there. Oh, good evening. Hi. Where are we? I'm not too bad. And then I have a fog of war. Ooh. And then it's over to you. Over to me? Yeah. Right. Well, let's start off with little Rifleman A over there. Mm -hmm. He's going to just uh, unpin him. Oh. He's been pinned there for No a longer suppressed. That's, yep. that's a terrible shame. Um, then we're going to spawn. She got her B. Ooh. He's going to spawn with Rifleman A. He can't. He has to spawn with oh, spawn Rifleman with B. Yeah, he does. Same platoon. Just the worst. <laughs> just the worst um, <laughs> he's quite bad um, at least you get an attack with him or you know what's it going to take to hurt him seven eight? oh he's a he's a reservist yes he's awful oh he's terrible he's literally awful he gets oh, one attack man. instead of two and three suppress instead of four. Oh yeah so he's yeah, just I, the worst yeah, yeah. <laughs> the two things that machine gunners are good for uh, he's downgraded mm. he's an idiot um I'm going to shoot. Mm -hmm. it's, 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 I'm going to risk it. Let's shoot right from a B. Right from a B? Yes. Three dice. Where's right from a B? Yeah. Oh, he's in there. So four, three, and one. So eight. Eight needed three, on three dice instead of four. Three dice suppression. Oh, there it is. Get it, though. Beautiful. That's yep. fine. I like that. Should have had your attack. Actually, I want to get one dice for that. You only get one dice? Yeah, yeah, no. Awful idea. Yeah, definitely don't even, do that. Why would you even suggest such a thing? Yep. And for um, your final trick? Right from a B. Ooh. He's going to shoot Scout B in the face. Oh, okay. Yeah, because yeah. he doesn't like him. Yeah, I can see why that would happen through sixes. Six needed. One attack. I missed the... Oh. Well, it was a seven. It was a seven out of the tray, but you... <laughs> outside the tray is like uh, on the floor. Doesn't, exactly. Doesn't yeah, count. Doesn't count, yeah. yeah. That's been the table. Right. Ooh, these are all quite good ones. Oh. oh. Don't do this to me. <laughs> oh. Don't do it to you. Right, okay. Yep. No, you can have it. Okay. But I oh all of my cards are so good. Oh, I didn't I didn't want to, I'm sorry. <laughs> ah well. Right. Yep. So where are they coming? Uh well you're not gonna like this one very much. I might. Engineer A is going to try and blow up right from the Right, uh, well, yeah. More bombs. That that makes sense. Because he always has more, doesn't he? Yep. Uh, so four and one. Yep. Recover. So fives. One, just, two dice. Just the five. With a bomb. Yeah, he's got hit. Yep. Definitely hit. Uh, <laughs> when I dig out, because there's none in my hand. While I'm digging these out, what else do you want to do? Uh, right from the A. Yep. He is going to control. Okay, yeah. Which put me up to three points. Uh, last but not least, we've got squad leader A, who's going to tell Rifleman A to move. Right. Oh, there it is. I thought he was a sniper there, but he's not. He was just an upgraded rifleman. He's a really good one. Oh, there you go. Oh, no. So uh, squad leader A is told Rifleman A, who was in here, to move into here with a little sniper move. Okay. And that's me. That's, that's my fogs, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. So, Rifleman B. Unpin, and then Rifleman B huh? will move in to there. Ah, uh, so we've got a, we've got a party going on in there, here. There's a <laughs> massive party and everybody's invited. Last card's a fog of war. So, as long as no aeroplanes are invited, Jerry, huh? <laughs> uh, at this stage, I wouldn't mind dropping one on there, just out of badness. <laughs> 
I mean, that would be horrendous. Oh, could you imagine it? <laughs> are, you, are you ready? This game gives me such hard choices. <laughs> this, I hate this game with passion. Ooh. Yeah, that was literally the worst card I have. <laughs> wow. Well, in my current situation, yeah, yeah. it's the best card, but you know, for right now, it's uh, not great. I didn't really have much in the way of choice, weirdly. No. <laughs> I looked at squad leader I and thought, yeah, you your go. squad are mostly in retreat, mate. <laughs> yeah. you, don't worry, you don't worry about it too much. The squad is mostly in the grave. Mm. Um, right, we'll start off with machine gunner. Thing. Yes. If I area suppress the yes. area my, I'm in, does it also suppress my guys? Yeah, you suppress everybody in there. It's the same oh, as a grenade or a bomb. Or that's just you're terrible. You're just strafing the whole square. Oh, utterly ridiculous. DP28 didn't have that much fire rate anyway. Um, let's go for just a two attack mm -hmm. onto Rifleman B, who's just joined us. Okay. Because uh, it's a welcome party. So Rifleman B, so it's that's fine. five. Your machine gunner is... There. Oh, he's actually in, he's the, in square. the same square. Oh, yeah. that's okay. <laughs> yeah, yes, indeed he is. I, I got temporarily confused because I remember you tried to put him far away. There's a six. There's a six. Yep. That'll work. And that was into my rifleman. Yes. Yes, it was. Ooh. Do I have one in my hand? Yes. Brilliant. Love it. Love it. Okay. Right. And next. Uh, next up, we've got rifleman B, who's mm -hmm. also in that same square. Yes. He's going to shoot rifleman B. Okay. What so attack. it's single dice on fives? Yep. Oh, he's hit. Ooh. Oh, he's hit. Don't have one in my hand. Good. Oh, there's one there. That's helpful. Uh, we, we really don't like your rifleman in this uh, in this army, so we're going to go engineer. Hey, um, we're bomb <laughs> On rifleman A. Bomb rifleman A, yes. All the way over here. <laughs> Indeed, yeah. Let's go for it. So that's another five dice. Yeah, they our five on two. Oh. Ooh. Big hits. Uh, I think I write back because I don't think I have any rifleman A's left. The Soviets love it. Two, don't three. I might have one actually. The Soviets love it. Nope. Oh, no, I don't. So well, that's my discard pile anyway. I may as well shuffle it. So rifleman A will also retreat to there. Good. He's also been routed. This is my turn. <laughs> Oh, okay. It's like that, is it, Mr. Man? <laughs> it's literally called Stalingrad. <laughs> hey, it literally you, is my you, time. You can say that all you want. <laughs> I'm going to start with my own sniper. Oh, I don't like that. With a four dice attack into your engineer A. But why? Because he keeps dropping bombs <laughs> on my men. That's but why. Never. He's a nice boy. Two, so tens, four dice attack on tens. Four dice. Yeah, Ooh. sniper elite. Ooh. Oh, three sevens. Oh, oh, oh man, oh. lucky sevens, not lucky enough. It was worth a punt. Yeah, yeah, worth oh, a shot. Yeah. You'll like this. Oh, one. <laughs> Is it a bomb? <laughs> it is a bomb. It's a bomb. It's a bomb. Are you going to bomb the party? I'm going to bomb the party. Nice. <laughs> because everybody in there deserves the party bombing. Everyone can agree on that. Yes, yes, they can. Uh, so it's a Two dice bombing run on everybody in there. The Veramact may have something to say. <laughs> Scouts on, well, my scout on six. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he gets yes. hit. Yes. Um, so I'll have to debigulate a scout B. Do I have any scout Bs that are all dead as well? I got a feeling a lot of people are dead right now. <laughs> yeah. So scout B is going to have to retreat. Good. Yep. So scout like B will go. Uh, if you can also hit Rifleman B. Not my rifleman B, your rifleman B. That no. would also be right. No, no, it wouldn't. No, sure? not bad. No, don't want to do that. I don't know. Uh, rifleman B is fives. Oh, he also Good. gets hit. <laughs> gets hit in a big way. Fantastic. He's also going to retreat. I'm, yes. I'm almost positive there's nobody in there. Oh, no, there is. There's a rifleman B in there. Oh. So that rifleman Darn. B goes. My rifleman B made us drop a grenade. It's <laughs> oh, no. Uh, your. Yes, yeah, so Rifleman B stays there. Your Rifleman B. Yes. Also gets hit on a six. Oh, Do you have any in there to peel out? Rifleman B, Rifleman B, Rifleman B, Rifleman B, Rifleman B. Why do I always miss them? Am I really that stupid? There he is. Grenade boy. He's gone. Good. And finally, the gunner on fives oh. also gets hit. Which one's he? Gunner B. Gunner B. Oh, no. Not to be confused with uh, 
Gunner Milligan, who's different. Good old Spike. That was he's a gone. successful bombing run, I feel. He's gone, yeah. He literally hit everyone. Yep. <laughs> that was a very good bombing run. That was an amazing whether, bombing run. Never whether they wanted it or not. What, what a shame that wasn't a destructible tile with a building on it. <laughs> it's already destroyed. So yeah, it's very much already destroyed. Already a few bombing runs on it. Okay. Next turn? Yep. Nice. Boosh, boosh. Yes. Fogs of War. All the Fogs of War. <laughs> if only had some scouts alive to remove them. That would be amazing. Oh, it? it would be so good. I oh, just dream, dream speak, about it. Speaking of which, you're a scout. Got one of those. And he's going to remove Fog of War. My Fog of War from the game for me. I'll draw another. Yeah. If it's not Fog of War, I'm going to. It's not our Fog of War. No. Something much better. Much better than a Fog of War. Much better, yes. Wow. Um, uh, we'll just play him now. It's a uh, Scout B. <gasps> down here. Dun, dun, in the dun. middle of uh, nowhere. Scout B. What you going to do when the Hulk runs wild, wouldn't you? Scout B's going to shoot at your sniper. Oh, okay. I think. Yeah. So five for cover, one more for the house he's in. Yep. And then one away. Yep. Seven. Seven, yep. One attack, one seven. Ah, uh, he's... No. Nah. No. He's a newbie. Look at him. Her. Sniper. <laughs> Another sniper. <laughs> Elite sniper. Whoa. Uh, do we have a sniper off? I think we have a sniper off. Yeah, sure. Let's have a sniper off. So six, seven, eight. On three dice. Yep. Yours is better. Wait, that's not... Oh, mine is repositioned, that's why. Yep. Uh, I just got more dice. Do you reposition? Is there any point in your reposition? No. No. No, no, you. no, the building you're in. There yep. isn't. Right. Eight. What did I need? Wow, eight. Oh, eight, eight. Oh. Wasn't it five, six, seven, eight? Seven, eight. eight. Yeah. There you go. Yeah. Sniper's head. Sniper's head. Do I have one in my hand? That would be annoying. No, I don't. No. no. Dang and blast. There is my sniper. First one I came to, it's the one with the four. Oh, no. It means the other one's got three, but reposition, same as yours. Oh. So. I see. Oh yeah, my four attack sniper is currently still in my supply. Okay. Are we all done? Yes, is it me? That's me. Yes, I'm here. Okay, well, in that case. Right, matey boy. Fog of war. I know I should leave it to last, but yeah. why bother? Yeah. Machine gunner. Get the, the disappointment out of the way first. Yeah. There you go. Uh, machine gunner is going to attempt to Shoot. Shoot. Shoot to kill Rifleman B. Wham. Two, three, four, eight. Two dice on eight. Mm. Let's hope he misses. No, he, he doesn't. Did not miss. Rifleman B. Mm. He's not very happy. Oh, Rifleman B. There he is. He's one of my good boys. He's gone dead. And then Rifleman B in that square will activate and he will attempt to shoot Rifleman B again. <gasps> Single dice on five. Oh, yes. Not this turn, Gadget. Not this turn. <laughs> Sweating over here. All right, Mr. Man. Oh, good times ahead. Try to do a bit of a reshuffle on my end. Right, let's, let's have a look. Two more of those. Oh, good times for all, Jerry. Good mm -hmm. times for all. Oh, I'm going to keep him just in with you. <laughs> there you go. My initiative. Right, um... Well, Machine Gunner B doesn't like that you've shot his mate. Yes. So he's going to shoot you. Okay. On B in the face. Fine. Two dice. Two dice on fives, right in there. Oh, he's hit. Ooh, he is hit. He is hit. It's right from the B, none of my hand. Oh. No. So what on my discard there is. So that makes life easier. Okay, next. Um. Next up, Engineer A. Ooh, it's been so long. He's going to demo the building he's in. He's going to demo the building. <laughs> yeah, he is. Out of badness. Just so we can show it off. Oh, well, Just so know. we can show it off. Yeah. Uh, so how does demoing work then? So demoing is 
uh, the value of the terrain you're in, which in this case is an eight, mm -hmm. and then the number of dice is the white with the little dash. Ah, so we get four dice. Four, beat an eight. four dice to beat an eight. Four dice to beat an eight. Let's go. I beat an eight. Two beat an eight. Man, you, you fiend. Dabby dozy. So <laughs> he does not care for his own safety. Apparently he does not. <laughs> If I just go, what are we in? 401? It's sort of bad to rig the bottom floor when the Germans walk in, he's still in the attic and still blows it up. So 401 should be about there. That's 402, so that's 401. So for this, this building gets somewhat leveled. So the amount of cover reduces from three to two. And also the, dam or the, the armor of it, the amount of damage you need to do also mm. drops from eight to seven. And you just put in the next highest number, uh, sorry, letter. So it goes 401A to 401B. And if you did it again, you go 401C. I'm just going to transfer that. Ooh. Stylish. To there. I'm very sad you haven't run into any of the mines. Just because I've seen you. We were watching you for days, <laughs> planting them all. And then 401A goes back in here and is not touched again. Beautiful. Right. Not really, but Last go on thing. there. Yep. We've got right from an A. Because you want to do control. Mm -hmm. This two square is on. Mm. And I've got five points. No, you don't. One, two, three. Four, oh, five. you do. I do. You do. I'd missed I'd missed one going through. I do do math. You do do math. I'd completely missed that one on the way. Yeah. But Congrats you well done. I just couldn't get over the line. No. I was on three for so long and then got routed back. <laughs> yeah. And this turn I had two fogs oh. and a squad leader, which I would have oh. used to bolster rifleman A's back into my hand to yeah, stop so them being routed. Couldn't have even done much. So yeah, no, it would have been Darn. would have been at least two turns away. One, two well, I'm not even sure if it would have been two turns. Did I have anybody that I could have commanded with left? platoon sergeant would have been in my hand mm. so yeah two turns with a command might have been able to bring it back and get yeah. the win there but engineer eh, man i'm telling you quality very well done tricky yeah. very tricky uh, there is a bit of post campaign work which i think we may as well run through and show people uh, no just so they know how it goes so uh when you've actually finished fighting the first thing you do is collect up your casualties. So these are the actual ones removed from the game. Don't count your fog of wars. So we've got four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So I have 10 casualties. There's a little chart in the book that tells you uh, that you have to draw so many cards depending on how many casualties you've taken. So I've I'm, only got eight. So you've got eight. Okay. So that's easy enough. So in this case, I would then put together my whole deck and then draw three cards. Uh, you need to, where are we? Redraw any ones who are already injured, essentially. Mm. Uh, so. So anyone who's already bad enough not to be replaced. Yeah. Again. So I'll be drawing three and you'll be drawing two. Yes. Uh, shuffle, or actually just shuffle your casualty pile and draw the number on the table below. If you draw a reserve card, return it to your supply and draw another one from your casualty pile to replace it. So your reserves can't get worse, but your uninjured ones can. Yes. Uh, if you would draw more cards than there are non-reserve cards in your pile, you draw as many as you can. So if it turns out, if it turns out I keep hitting the very badly damaged bees, uh, yeah, well. that may go away anyway. There's quite a few, they're sort of bloodied, so you're gonna battered. Got Scout A, he's already messed up. Oh, there's a late rifleman A. Late rifleman A's been. Oh, A squad have getting demolished. Been, been oh. somewhat stabbed up. Gosh darn. Uh, so, my elite sniper would get it. Uh, rifleman B who is oh. the only member of B squad <laughs> who's not injured yet. We get it. Well, he's injured now. <laughs> and scout Oh, two elites, Anna, your only, yeah. only B squad. Now, the interesting thing about this is your reserves can't get worse. Your upgrades can, 
but people like the sniper who are limited just will go away. So in the same way that oh. Shay only has two snipers, oh, yes. I've now only got two in my supply, so he's dead forever and goes in the dead forever box. Uh, all of the numbers on the cards, so this is Rifleman B, who's actually 015. He has a, uh, in fact, he's right at the top. He has a version in the reserve pile. So when you when you take a specific casualty, you remove a specific card to go with. So now this one is another rifleman who uh, he can only attack in the same square he's in. So not ideal. And my scout goes from being elite down to being a reservist as well. And that is uh, a terrible, terrible shame. Scout nine. Oh, my, my Rifleman A, like Rifleman B, has decided to swap his Mosin for a Tokarev for some reason. <laughs> and Scout A, Scout A has decided that he doesn't really conceal anything anymore. He doesn't care. Makes sense. Makes sense. As you do. Uh, so now, you will always have your Scout, Machine Gunners and Rifle Squads at full capacity, but often weaker. However, your unlocks can drop down as sort of diminishing supplies of men and materiel. Uh, next thing you do is, they are fine. Put your deck together, it says, uh, ignoring fog of war cards, and then you draw two and they get upgrades. Uh, if they've already been upgraded, obviously you can't. So there's a chance that even though some people have weathered the storm better than others, that they may get a bit of a, a boost. Uh, if you draw an upgrade, a reserve, a command, or a fog of war card, return it and draw again. So you're only going to be upgrading your eligible sort of decent cards. Mm -hmm. I'll give them a shuffle because obviously my supply was all in there as well. How many upgrades do we draw? Just two. Just two. Just two. We've got Scout B, who's messed up, and Rifleman A, who's fine. Scout A is a reservist and engineer. Uh, so the reserve card, you need to draw another one if he's already damaged. So another engineer. But otherwise, then you would upgrade those. If there are fewer than two eligible cards, you draw as many as you can to upgrade. So towards the end of the campaign, you're going to be left with the very, very best and the walking wounded. Mm. Uh, and again, you'd pull those from the upgrade deck uh, in whatever order it is. So for these, it's 44 and 45. So in this case, my engineers, one of them gains smoke as a new ability. And not sure what the other one gets. Oh, he gets to deploy two mines a turn. Cool. And again, those cards then go into your we don't need them anymore pile. My rifleman A has decided to pick up a grenade. Oh, and, that's never uh, good. Just as your engineer has decided to pick up a smoke as well. Okie dokie. So I pop those back in there and that is my army ready to go for the next mission. And because the Soviets won, they would uh, follow the, the tree in Scenario 51 is the one we were playing. Scenario so. 51. Da, da, da. Scenario 51, if I'm to win, Soviet victory, 6A. Okay. Oh. And then you just flip to the front and it will tell you what 6A will be and where we'll be going. So I'm just curious more than anything else. Obviously, we won't read it out because we're already spoiling quite a bit. Yes. Oh, okay. Yeah, that would be interesting. You don't want to see that. That would be terrible. That would make me cry. But there you have it. Undaunted Stalingrad. The living undaunted experience. Mm. Nothing stays the same in Stalingrad. Everything changes. True. True. Uh, let us know what you think below of the new developments for Stalingrad and the campaign system and narrative. Uh, if you have any questions about Undaunted as a whole, drop them below and we'll pass them over to the people 
best suited to answer them at Osprey. Until next time, folks, bye-bye. Hi, everybody. It's Undaunted Week here on Tabletop.com, and we have a huge prize bundle that you could win. Our lucky winner will receive copies of Undaunted Normandy, North Africa, Reinforcements, Stalingrad, and we're even throwing in a signed copy of the Roland Revenge art book. Get your comments in on the YouTube channel and on Tabletop.com for your chance to win. Go ahead and check out our other content on screen now. And while you're at it, why not hit subscribe and remember to ding our dong. Go on, you know you want to click it. Go on.